Energy security is integral to economic development for South Africa in our view and our view is that government as the policy maker have to play the leading role in determining energy policy that will encourage private sector investment and development. This will enable the achievement of economic development goals. We argue, Chair, that money is available out there that would assist ESCOM through investments to achieve its objectives if the right conditions prevailed to enable that money which is in private hands to be released into ESCOM in order to be able to meet the requirement of future energy security. Approach must consider strategic issues which are important to ensuring security of supply and the sustainability of the electrical generation and distribution simultaneously with the consideration of the pricing matters. The finalization of the integrated resource plan is expected to provide details of South Africa's energy plan. And we argue, Chair, that it is vital that that plan is finalized and released and decisions on investments and funding be taken within that IRP. In a similar way, the integrated energy modeling and integrated energy master plan needs to be finalized urgently by government. A strategic discussion further on the appropriate regulation of the electricity market is critical as part of the discussion on long-term challenges. Progress must be made towards the signing of any PPAs which will indicate that the enabling environment for IPPs is now conducive. Clear policy directive in our view on renewable energy, co-generation and non-ESCOM coal and gas based generation have become vital so that we don't continue chair to build a monopoly that would ultimately lose even the capacity and the ability to manage the supply of energy in the long term.